In this video, I will show you how to use Zapier with ChatGPT. So first, go and sign in to your Zapier account. And from here, what you want to go and do is click on Explore Apps. Now, there's a lot of different things you can do with ChatGPT in Zapier. You can integrate it with pretty much any app on Zapier and have it do whatever you want. And using AI in your apps gives you so much more customizability options and you can do more advanced things using Zapier. So if you want to use it, just go and search for ChatGPT right here. Then in the top, you will see it, so go and click on it. Then here, click on connect ChatGPT to over 6,000 apps. And now here, you can start building the Zapier events. So first, here you have ChatGPT, where you can select an event. Now, if you don't want to start with ChatGPT, then you can also change it to be something else first. So the first step could also be if you have a Facebook lead, for example. So let's say Facebook lead ads right here. Then I could make this one. Then I could just start with a Facebook lead ads and later add in chat and later add in ChatGPT. But for now I'll just do it like this. So in ChatGPT you can choose a trigger event. So you can just search for something. And then first you want to also go and sign in to your ChatGPT account right here. So in order to find your API key for ChatGPT, you just want to head over to platform.openai.com forward slash API dash keys. And then here, click on create new secret key. Now here you can give it a name and then add it to a project. And then for the permission, and then here you can choose the permissions. Then click create secret key right there. Now, if you don't have a project yet, then what you need to do is here in the top, you will see right now I've got one called 12, but here you have your projects and you can click create project. And from here, just click create new secret key. Then here you can give it a name and click create secret key. Now here you have your key, so go ahead and copy it. Then go back to Zapier and here add in the API key and click yes, continue to ChatGPT. And now you will be signed into your account. And now you have connected your Zapier to JetGPT and you can now do whatever you want with it. So then after doing this, just go ahead and test it and see if it works. But now you can do whatever you want with JetGPT in your Zapier account. So now you know how to use Zapier with JetGPT. If this video was helpful, please consider leaving a like and subscribing to my channel. With that being said, I will see you in the next video.